All right, testing, testing. <clears throat> Okay, um, that's set up, right? So we can delete. There we share this. my friend because they're the one who bought this game for me they said i'd really enjoy it but uh, i don't know if they're around to see me play it oh. <sighs> we'll give that a moment <sighs> sleepy sunday day for horror outside it's getting dark it's gloomy cold miserable perfect all right i think we can begin let me mute this so i stop echoing Fire up the game. So we're going to put this on black screen for the moment. Now, oh, 48 megabytes. That's a lot. This title is a pre-release beta and might not function as expected. It's fine. Cult capital of Japan. Options. It's fine. What is this? One bit mode? Two bit mode? G bill? Two bits? I'm not sure which I like better. Yeah, full screen's fine. Two to one ratio? Oh, yeah, that's okay. Oh, yeah, I don't like that. It was one to one. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, I guess the other window there is cool. JC80. Uh, what is this? There was a color mode too. Oh, here we go. Like extra information runs off the the text runs off it. That's funny. Creepy neighbor. <laughs> Suitcase screen. Yeah, I thought there was a um. Color palette you can introduce, but maybe not. That's fine. We'll leave it on, on one bit, I think. Just for the initial experience. This is very much like an original Mac look. 
Uh, let's see what's in here. Extra. Oh. Achievements. Bestiary. Pantheon. Odds. Oh, Alright. Let's get into it. Oh, there are color panels. Oh, that's cool. I saw someone, a screenshot, uh, someone had, like, I don't even know how they did it. Um, oh, some of these are really glaring in the eyes. It was like the old, oh, what was that format? CGA? Where it was white and black and, like, magenta and, like, teal. And, like, they thought it was Vaporwave, and I'm like, that's what games actually used to look like. <laughs> I thought that was really cool, but, uh, I'm not sure how to get that. Uh, besides hitting randomize a bunch, and I don't feel like doing that, so. Leave it on this. First time playing World of Horror, I just recommend you start with the spine-chilling story of school scissors option. Shiokawa, Japan. Something strange is happening in our town. Road figures can be seen gathering in the woods at night. Or gathering in the dog park. There are no dogs allowed in the dog park. Rapid technological progress of the modern era brings comfort, but also new unknown threats. I recognize that, I can't remember what that, um, sigil is called. It shows up in the Doom games as well. Old gods, malicious eldritch beings who ruled the earth eons ago are awakening as reality starts to crumble. All because we're s sucked into our cell phones? Is that Masato? Armed with clues, spells, and your dwindling sanity, you'll investigate mysteries across the city and in realms beyond. The end of the world is at hand, and you finally arrived in the doomed town of Shiokawa. Okay, so I assume this is my character. Okay, so we got spells, status. It's about uh, 17 months before I was born. <laughs> following the weird cult for weeks now. Barely surviving the encounter of the skin hag at the nursery. The what? <laughs> it's a race against time and you can't rest until our town is safe. Tentacular. Another boy from your school has disappeared. Rumor has it a terrible woman has returned from the grave. A woman with the widest smile and the sharpest scissors. Maybe your friend is up something and left you as a notebook full of cryptic notes. I can send her back where she belongs. It is a ritual that can stop the wicked woman once and for all. What's the worst thing that could happen? Famous last words. Tainted Flux, welcome! It's going well, how are you doing? I just started this. Uh, it's my first time playing this, so I'm going through a little bit of a tutorial area. To stop the tall woman with scissors, you'll need to perform a ritual to force a material form to appear in our dimension. The drawing of an eldritch sigil and the lighting of holy candles. Okay.
Uh, I'll be your new biology teacher. Could you help me move some stuff to my new office? Uh, okay, let's see. Creepy substitute teacher hands you some old books to carry. Among the mundane titles, you find one called Extinction of Mankind. Listen, Chuck, I found all the candles I found. That is the um, sign of uh, uh, Haster, the king in yellow. No, wait. Maybe that's Nyarla Totep. Ah, I forget which it is now. I think it's Haster. Um, let's check out the school lockers. Okay, that's uh. Oh, what symbol is that? That's sulfur. That's I think mercury. His eyes. It's been a long time since you've seen her played a horror game. Well, it's the spooky month, so it's the perfect time for it. Um. Whoa. Oh. That's, uh, hmm. Okay, we won't go in that locker. A oh, baseball bat. I oh, you found our new items. I think that's just automatically my inventory now. You need a tiny key to open this locker. Oh, I forgot to turn off notifications. Give me a second here. Check the desks. So, hey, no weapon. But it's Sade. Yeah, how do I equip it? There we go. Enter the biology classroom. It seemed empty at first. Lying in a pool of blood is one of the teachers with a fruit knife in their hand. Jar from L to hide on the nearest table. Wait. Mesmerized by the spiral pattern of the sea creature's skin. What sea creature? I assume there's one on the table or in the jar from L to hide? Okay. Voice is stuttered. Whoa. Oh, this is combat, okay. Forgotten specimen. During each turn, you'll build a sequence of attacks and moves from the action ring. Action ring. Okay. Oh, that's this. Once you've filled the sequence bar, press the launch sequence button to finish your turn. Kick it. That's apparently my only option. I guess I'll just keep kicking it. This damage after each sequence enemies from an attack during your stamina, reason, or both. Where's my reason at right now? I have no idea. Um, with time, you'll discover new combat moves available through the action filter. First, you need a weapon. Or an improvised weapon. Oh, if 
found a new item, Broken Bottle. I missed the attack. This is very strange. Um, it still has eight hit points. What is a strong attack? You missed, you missed, you involuntary attack yourself. What? Also, where is my hit points? Oh, that's stamina. Okay. And reason that's my sanity level. Um <sighs> guess we'll just keep hitting it until it dies. Hey. Found an item, lump of flesh. I'll just stick that in my pocket. <laughs> the blessed chalk was left on the roof. You must hurry and find it. My hand on drag the mouse. Uh hmm. <laughs> do. Hey, Lyra. I think what this is. Inspect. Slimy and smelly, what is it? It's pulsating slowly in your hand. What's medicine? Should I, should I eat it? In a new status. Holes. What? <laughs> oh no, it's a curse. Each day more holes appear. Oh no. <laughs> no achievement unlocked. Let's uh, explore the school. Is wrong. Instead of a clear blue sky, you see the bloated corpse of a long forgotten deity looming over the school's roof. The air between worlds is coming apart. Dexterity check failure. You raise your head, your head in time to see Athelazith's single eye glaring down at you. He screams, Your mind is flooded with forbidden knowledge, and your skin is etched with ancient runes and curses. Great, Cursed Signs. What does this do to me now? Casting spells raises doom. Charred skin forms weird signs. Well, I found the chalk. Interesting, I can redraw the sigil. I need the candles, though. This is the sigil I need to actually draw? It doesn't look like the one that was on the board. Minus one reason. The sound of scissors is getting louder. Old trophy case. One metal seems particularly valuable. This person involved in the current case was a prize-winning swimmer. Okay. Oh, I got the candles. Let's perform the ritual. Oh. Oh god. It'll seem to have any effect on the horrible monster. Have you drawn it wrong? Yeah, I think so. Resident Fury watches the twitching horror gets closer and closer. It raises its enormous scissors and croaks, Am I beautiful? She 
is definitely not. 30 hit points. Oh crap. Sign. Okay. Oh, um. Oh, that skill. Guaranteed hit, that's interesting. Slash Scissor Woman, minus four health, stabs me. Ow. Try dodging. Oh, it needs a oh, it, oh, okay. Uh, that. I missed, but I dodged it. Uh, let's try that one again. Three health to her. Oh, she stabbed me though. Um, hmm. What are these spiritual actions? Clap? Oh. Hey. That's interesting. Combat rituals are a combination of five bows and claps. If you don't get it right, you'll be provided with a hint. I'm curious, let's try that. So let's clap, clap, bow, clap, clap. Got three ritual moves right. Oh god. ones though. <laughs> what? I'm not dealing with that. Oh, I hate that kind of guesswork. Let's just stab her a whole bunch. You miss, you miss. What? I need health. Damn it. Clip the broke. You don't have time. Oh, that's weird. Oh, it's an actual move to do that. Oh, that's annoying. Okay. Um. Uh, 
Where was the... This? Oh yeah, okay. So how much does this do? I think she killed me. Yep. <laughs> God damn it. Feel your cheeks split in half. You sustained a new injury. Slit mouth. Womp womp. play this This sigil can weaken the demon for a while. Careful with the lines. Okay, so if it doesn't look like that, it's not going to work. I've hidden the candles in one of the classrooms. Formal in us almost, almost makes you drop the jar. Should fetuses have so many legs? <laughs> mm. Hear a faint sound walking inside the biology classroom. In an old anatomy model, its heart is beating. What the fuck? Shock was left on the roof. Here's the older tour. Um, let's run this time. Grab the backpack and turn the staircase leading back to our world. Plus ten experience. Ooh. that one. Yeah, okay. There we go. Now I need candles. 
You're stopped by a girl you haven't seen in months. How could you? She died in an accident. Oh dear. Um. Oh fuck, I don't have any weapons. Oh shit. Oh, no worries, Flux. Welcome back. Punch Stalker Girl. She bit me. Oh, she regained health from that? Uh, Alright, we're gonna keep doing this, I think. Since this is working. Doom. Um, I don't. What is my Doom level? Where do I see that? Hmm. Seems to be alright. Candles. School gym, you know, it's a strange black doll propped up against the wall. Against your better judgment, you approach the doll. What you see makes you gasp in horror. The doll isn't a doll. Your sudden movement causes tiny black spiders to flee, revealing a white, half eaten corpse. Oh, that's a lot of spiders. Okay, found the candles. Go, boss fight. A writhing amorphous mass slowly takes shape. Soon it becomes a tall, woman like creature with three faces all connected by a wide smile. This is your only chance. Wants to know if she's beautiful. Uh, well, I still don't have a weapon, so. Same as last time. Let's hope I have enough health. Stabbed me. For minus two. Oh, I missed an attack. Not good. Horror lies dead on the classroom floor, slowly dissolving into nothingness. Find your friend, gravely wounded but alive. He's got slit mouth going on, or she. Hmm. Let's see. Hey, mana. Um, I think it auto-saves. I shouldn't have to worry about that. It is a weird fucking game. Absolutely. 
I am totally here for it. Let's, uh, you know what? I'm gonna turn on 2-bit. Oh, look, it did the thing! See, this is like, uh, CGA graphics, like back in the day. Oh, that's cool. I like that a lot. I'm gonna keep that on. Unless it does this, I don't like that much color. Like, we'll see. So th I think quick play is the way you're supposed to play through. That'll give you access to all the different stories randomly selected. Is that right, Mana? Can you confirm that for me? The destruction of the Library of Alexandria, a perfect black marble statue has been recently rediscovered and is currently awaiting in the Museum of Our Town for its premiere. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Um, both you and enemies deal extra damage. Got a new item, camera. Really neat. Welcome, thank you for trying World of Horror. In this short tutorial, I'll do my best to explain various elements from creative fight the old gods. You know, it would have been nice if it started with this. You know, manage your surroundings, solve mysteries, and fight enemies. It's the user interface part of the screen. You manage your inventory, cast spells, and access game options. Knowledge, Charisma, and Funds. Okay. Yeah, this is pretty interesting so far. Um, inventory. Give up to four items. I have three equipment slots. Equipment items do not count towards the four items in the limit. Trinkets and armor. Okay, so I can only have one weapon. Spell status options. Okay, so town status. You. Old god. Okay. No, I already know how combat works. Change clothes. Peek through people. It's out there. Nothing. <laughs> it 
dentist found guilty of implanting dog teeth on their human patients. Motive is currently unknown. It's funny, because the last horror game had a dog with human teeth. Action required empty bottle. Do you collect your, your gamer girl bath water? <laughs> Alright, um. I guess we'll go back to here. Check out the lighthouse. and morbid events have been plaguing your town for some time now. You've marked down five of them, hoping that there is something connecting them. Hmm. I wrote Fable of a Fear Festival. Bizarre Brute of the Blood-Curdling Botanist. Sorrowful Saga of the Moonlight Sailors. Eerie episode of Evolving Eels. Horrible history of household hell. Ooh, do we want Evolving Eels or household hell? Hmm. All right, Flux, catch you later. Have a good night. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, I appreciate it. Um, I'm thinking eels. I like eels, they're neat. I also taste good. Um, did you know it's Kana? That weird dude is back. You know, the one who studies fish? Kana follows, immediately enters the kitchen. They return with two cans of soda. Aren't you curious what weird fish did he bring this time? Sure, let's find out what fish they have. Investigate the circled locations. You progress the location, the rules may change. I saw the creepy neighbor carrying some jars inside his apartment. Inside location twice. Well, I want me to go to apartments. I have a moment to talk about our real lord and savior? Day of reckoning is coming. <laughs> your ideas intrigue me, and I wish to subscribe to your newsletter. Humanity is doomed. He's working at school, right? We could break into his office. What do you mean we shouldn't? Why is this person so hard on for checking out this guy's fish? <laughs> Something gigantic and invisible leaves a deep void in the sea. It's not moving, but you swear it's watching you. Ocean is hungry. You're stopped by a person with a knife. They look incredibly sad. It wants me, but I'm afraid I'm too much of a coward to do it myself. Can you help me? Uh, take them out of it? I hand you the knife and thank you. Something is watching you from the sea. Ritual dagger. Let's equip that. You never know when you might need a knife. Is there more than one? Okay. One bumps into you and quickly apologizes. 
Do you realize your wallet is missing the thief is luck? <laughs> oh, what the hell? Petty thief. And a few jars, all filled with weird eel-like fish. Despite your protests, kind of decides to take one jar home. You ever seen an eel like this? It's so freaky. Don't you have a feeling it's watching us? Lead so far. It idolizes you and you're ready for the investigation. Jesus, alright. Burning notes behind our apartment building. What's he building in there? Up your lunch, you find a pile of letters in your mailbox. Seems you want a small amount of money in the lottery. Lucky you. Plus two funds. Take that, petty thief. <laughs> now you begin to wonder if spying on your neighbor is a good idea to begin with. side of the door. Oh god, what is that? Apartment stalker. Get out of your stalker. Uh, shit. Okay. <laughs> Sustain a new injury. Concussion. Oh no. Stabbing it, I guess. Oh no. Oh, I missed faces right there. I'm doing so hot. Bash you in the head with a baseball bat. Jerk. What else I can do with it? What is this? Camera flash. Aha! Take that. Got the baseball bat. I think I'll actually equip that, because... What is this one? Damage 4, speed 75, chance to hit 60. Or 95, chance to hit 80. Yeah, I'm definitely equipping that instead. What's he building? Wish you could throw this damn jar in the trash. Why can't you? Uh, can I heal? I guess I can only do stuff like that outside of a mystery. Oh wait, no. Travel to home. Oh, okay. Do I have a healing spell? No. What can Kana do for me? Okay. Oh, I can level up. What? Oh, okay. Interesting. Ithotu, the Devouring Flame. Entropy. Both you and all enemies deal extra combat damage. Hmm. Okay. Oh. Going to the seaside. Patient's threat level increases. Do 
I sleeping at the seaside? Uh-oh. Where is Kana? Oh, you know what? I didn't look at these notes. Legend from the prefecture eels tell of a small village of robbers who would kill all visitors and dump their corpses into a lake full of eels. That's lovely. Plus curse. Oh, jeez. One's following me. Minus one knowledge to the end of the mystery. Oh. Investigating the seaside and not finding anything. Against a whirl, a supernatural wave of freezing wind is approaching. Success. Oh. Oh, I thought that was the. Okay. Rooms cluttered with half-finished sculptures and bizarre masks hanging on the wall. One sculpture strikes you as eerily realistic. Uh, well, the sculpture's a naked woman, so I'm definitely checking that out. Looks so lifelike, you move closer and raise your hand to touch it. It falls off. <laughs> oh no! Why does it want my head? Look at your own! Um... Shit. Uh, I can't blind the enemy if it doesn't have a head. Let's do that. And that. Ow. I really need to heal. Been missing since yesterday. You decided to check out the neighbor's apartment yourself. Why is there blood on everything? Oh. Countless jars filled with eels. body of your neighbor is rotting away inside putrid murky water. Both his eyes are missing with countless tiny blood trails leading from them in all directions. Hmm. Find Kana. His eyes burst. I slipped on the blood and lost consciousness. I'm afraid there's something in my own eye now, too. Uh-oh. C for coward, I guess. <laughs> huh, okay. Mystery solved. The old god stirs. 
Fetid fumes. The air feels heavy, making it hard to breathe. Sound status. Feeling paranoia and discomfort is almost palpable in the air. As doom progresses, Old God's influence will slowly corrupt and change this calm seaside town. Um... That's my allies. I don't have any. Oh, I can level up. Where is that? Advance to the next experience, I'll choose one perk and one stat upgrade. Chosen nothing and nothing. Oh, they're over here. Uh, plus one, two, strength. I don't know, we're gonna do stamina for sure. Actually, like heal. <laughs> That's funny. Reporter, why? Junior salary man, Chad. <laughs> Empty bottle. Hold hell. Haunted by a family four, disappeared without a trace. Friends you've talked with are not sure where the mansion itself is located. Turn to the library may shed some light on it. Wait, what is this? You could fill this bottle with something. Guessing P. So I'm at the school. You feel the gaze of a librarian. Oh, I listen to enough uh, Night Veil vale to know that's a bad thing. Any of the books you can find here were donated after the accident at the university building. What you're looking for a new spell. <clears throat> Start to miss the most obvious leads. What? Must be somewhere near the cliffs. You copy the mansion's photo from the newspaper and prepare to leave. Shiva. Energy drink, camera, flash, 
actually it's super Who is coming, and now you know the dates. Mark your calendars. I only find the one. There's only one problem. You'll need a strong rope to enter the mansion through the high window. Hmm. Got a weirdly colored rock, covered in black algae. Not a rock. Oh god. It needs another body now. Hmm. Does it have eyes? I could try the camera. There's a thing I can do, like, only once when my health is low. <laughs> Yay. Did I die anyway? That encounter was the final straw. Your mind has snapped and you've been locked up in an asylum. It would be comforting to accept that you were insane, that no old god is awakening to devour humanity. The drugs haven't made these horrors disappear. Womp womp. Seemingly supernatural skills. Got stars disappearing from the night sky. This thing spells raise doom instead of its normal cost. a Ouija board shirt because it just looks like a slice of pizza and asking yes or no. <laughs> Which, it's pizza. Gotta say yes. Unless I'm at BLFC. 
Um, okay, we'll go with that. Oh wait, it didn't stick. What this outfit? Looking good. Still, yeah. Oh, it didn't stick. Oh no, it's down here. Okay. Rotten report of a rancid ramen. Uh oh. This old hell. My sailors. Freaky feature of found footage. The school scissors. Oh, let's do this one. stuff themselves dish, dish after dish while the blind odor sits silently behind the counter grinning and polishing his gleaming knives what is its true power dog meat human meat flesh of the gods themselves <laughs> it's funny that they jump to that it's probably just got like cocaine in it this drama shop Increase my electric bill. Our master is coming, and we all can bask in its glory. Whoa! Magician glitched! <laughs> No weapons. Can I run away? Is that an option? No. Ask your ally to distract the enemy. Oh, I can look for a weapon. Branch! I am now a branch manager. Throw it. Actually, seem to be damaging me. Just doing weird stuff. Oh, no. Let's try this. Oh, of course, I miss. Fuck. Because he's glitched, he's not actually damaging me. Oh, oh no, wait. Strength. Oh, like the actual attribute. Uh, shit. Oh, huh. I guess this is my combat effectiveness? Strength based.
Hmm. Damn it. Alright, so now I'm standing in line for the ramen place. People don't want to talk to me about it. Check for an improv weapon, also. We'll see years since a childhood friend moved to another city. I apologize, asked you to remove the furniture from his flat because he wants to sell it. Find a key to his apartment. Moving through the, the wardrobe, you take a wrong step and sprain your ankle. God damn. This character is almost as unlucky as I am. The smell around the restaurant is overpowering. Grease, rot, and blood. Mm -mm. Learned by the sound of glass breaking, scare the corpse of a policeman lying in a pool of blood. It looks like someone or something tore out his throat. Steal his gun. He won't be needing it for sure, but you still feel bad about stealing from corpse. Eh, it's fine. Wow, a gun! One ramen, please. As I shakily point a police revolver at him. Give me the ramen! Uh, illicit firearm, one-handed. Her oh, perception? Damage on shot, nine. Wow. My father's old service revolver. To think how many deserters he shot in the head with this. Um. New Manbu N60, designed in the 60s. Huh. I wonder if that's an actual revolver. Uh, I'm not gonna use it yet. I'll use up the branch, I think. Hmm. Asked a seal and holding a baseball bat. Oh. Rioter? What are they rioting against? What are them new uh mask up though? Let's see. Filled with fuel. Uh, I don't have time to change the equipment. That sucks. How long is it? What? Why does it say that? Like, how long would it take? distract him. Oh no, <laughs> they threw a Molotov at me. That's not cool. Any spells? Show me what you got, loser. Oh, I don't think I can kill him. 
And I can't run either. Oh wait, I can. For a doom penalty. Oh, uh, let's just hide. Hmm. How do you heal in this game? I feel like there should be a way to do that. Himself, touching a festering wound on his cheek. Grow teeth? What the fuck? Hand, you fill a vial with the soup and walk out without tasting the weird dish. Escape the lab. Get into the ramen and then into a lab. While handing over the gathering material to hesitate, what should you send to the laboratory? A day later, your friend rings her door, her face is pale, and she hands you an analysis sheet, ushering and bolt the door. Discovered a highly addictive drug in the broth. Please find an. Please in an official stand where the ramen restaurant used to be. What? I think they're, they accidentally a word or two there. Nothing remains but a gap in the street and aimless, confused customers. Brief articles about an exciting new ramen restaurant opening and its mysterious owner keeps showing up. Ending B. Cool. Old God stirs. Oh. Uh. Okay. Well, let's do this. Oh wait, no. I Shit, I can't get to my storage from here, can I? Damn it. I got one. Make a <laughs> Oh no. That's terrible. Yeah, but... <sighs> okay. I don't remember. Next time I start, if I get the bottle, I gotta bring it into the tub and collect my Gamer Girl bathwater, and apparently I'm guessing that'll be a healing item. revealed an entrance to a partially flooded cavern system. Hmm. Let's do the scissors one again, um, since I kind of know what I'm doing with that one. That's the symbol we need to make. 
Seven pointed star with a loop. a certain secluded location. Let's go up with a note signed by your friend. Loaded body of Athiolazoth is getting closer. I'm a gird. Um. Let's check out the masks. My storage? Yes. Not enough room for an item. That's creepy. Small chance of ignoring reason loss in combat. Okay. Nice. Drifting on a swimming board in the middle of the pool. Could it be what you were looking for? Oh god. In the water. Water turns murky. You realize you're not alone in the pool! Loaded figure emerges. Loaded teacher. That's not cool. <sighs> I found the chalk. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and the loop. Yeah, this should be right. The candles. We discovered smog. Black smog emerges from the courtyard. I'm gonna run from the window. Enter the biology classroom. The room seems not to have first. You switch the lights on. Each has a fruit knife in their hand. Jar of formaldehyde. Sparrow. Yeah, okay. Candles! Alright, let's do this. Oh, right, I have to fight it, and I only have two health? Oh, I'm so fucked. There's nothing I can do, is there? Shut up. Okay, then then do it. Treatment insert. Oh, it's passive. Oh, fuck. Go get him. <laughs> Burns. Reason, but it does cost stamina. Oh, I 
am so boned. Can I do... Is it meditate? Doubles all damage down. Oh, it's not gonna help. That's definitely not gonna help me. Oh fuck. Alright, just send it. Atarasu is once again awakening from its slumber. We're gonna tear down the walls of its cocoon prison. Stop it before it devours us all. You can't escape from combat encounters. Oh god. Alright. I guess that's the only way you can heal. Maybe that's what the store is for? You buy food there? But I don't remember ever seeing food in there. It's just somewhere else I can go. Students disappeared in the process of making a documentary about local folklore and legends of the nearby forest. On the first anniversary, a suspicious man has started asking questions. Hmm. Mansion location twice, okay. Just feeding on a human finger. Hey, spiders gotta eat too. What does that say? Adorasu? Oh, that's the god, isn't it? Yeah. No to mention a village not far from your town. You decide to take a bus. A large number of trees that have suddenly died. What is this? Patina ring? Oh, is this on the finger? It's uh 
put that. Minus two max stamina. No, never mind. I don't want to worry about it. Oh, can I sell it? Tasty. Oh no. Itchy tasty. Right. Oh, shop for items. Random discounted item. Some decks. Oh, this compass. What's to experience for each investigated location? Real good. Okay, I'm gonna get that. Here's equip. What about a weapon? Guess I'll worry about that when I get into combat. There are some twists and turn when you're not looking, trapping you in this neighborhood. Get lost. Really exhausted you end up on the main street as the passage to the blighted neighborhood slowly closes behind you. Huh. Everyone in the village is unsettlingly friendly. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna buy that knife. Oh, wait. Ghost type. Too bitten. Putting your hand in that hole is a bad idea. Seeing the big spider escape, you hope it wasn't poisonous. I'm sure it wasn't, but it is venomous. I have to be that guy. Looking back on this time, you continue deeper into the woods. Uh, click a square to explore it. Um, do we want woods? Woods? Uh, maybe woods? Or. Uh, I think woods. Some water. I've got another human finger. Hmm. <laughs> Why did I lose stamina for that? You find a pile of human teeth lying on a nearby rock. Oh, so this is Blair Witch Project. Let's see. Oh, okay. Oh, interesting. Sudden storm forces you to find shelter in a nearby cave. They discover strange markings in the cave's well. You recognize the strange stones connected to the horrors plaguing your town. Petty thief. You saw your wallet. You quickly grab their arm and they drop it for disappearing the crowd. Weird to run into them in the forest, but okay. Strange carvings on the trees. On the right trail. It's a little. Parasitic organism burrows under the bark, undulating slowly. Let's cut it open. Yeah. Quench your thirst with the dark red sap. <laughs> what? Now I have infected wounds? Hmm. Hmm. 
bite mark is getting worse with each day. God. I spot a pair of legs sticking out of a bush. They twitch and move. Arc Woman. 18 health. Hails you with a branch. Ow. You know what? I probably do two for each of these. Oh, no. if I missed all three of those. All the paths look the same. Are you lost? Trapped dog? Oh no. I'm gonna help it. Oh, an ally! Hooray! Can you pet the dog? my allies. Dog. Wolf. <laughs> Dog is wagging its tail. Dog barks knowingly. Okay, I'm gonna assume this counts as petting the dog. Just let go. <clears throat> Tree branches hang over the path. Almost inspiring. Lost in thoughts. Oh no. Oh no, a hole is clumsily covered with branches and leaves. Aw, oh, son of a bitch. I'm feeling of being watched. There's someone standing in the trees. Let's confront them. It's a creepy scarecrow. Rotten fruit, some on a shrine. Let's pray. Discover a severed human hand behind the statue. <sighs> Rumored witch house seems empty. In the basement, however, we find a camera pointed at the large hole in the ground. Three cassettes. I'm curious how coming from the hole. So it's probably the ending of the thing. Got another one of these? Um. Peek inside. Looks well, press your look inside. A gigantic eye staring right at you. Lose consciousness. Oh no. Suspicious tall man grabs you by the collar. He explains he is a part of a cult protecting the house and the mysterious entity below it. You've got a bigger purpose than to die here, he says before knocking you out. You wake up a few hours later on a bus heading back to your town. Forest is restless. What's three doom? Huh, okay, cool. Old God stirs. Roads leading out of town were closed by the police, so I'll have to find a new way out. Huh. Take the key. And I should definitely take a bath. Stamina, experience, reason. Uh, I'm gonna go with reason. Help. Hmm. 
Oh, I can level up. Close quarters combat training. Improvise cult signs. But tell me. Oh, okay. Using firearms as melee weapons deals more damage. Throwing items during encounters is more fun. I forgot you can do that. Small experience bonus for casting spells. Um, I'm assuming if you throw an item, it leaves your inventory. Uh, I'm gonna go with this one just in case. You know what? Yeah, let's re-roll, actually. Parting gift. Letting allies go grants permanent bonus one of your stats. Fast hands, switching equipment during combat encounters. Oh, that's good. We'll go with that one. And let's up our stamina. Started. The woman next door was strangled to death in her bed with no sign of forced entry. The killer was never found and the apartment remained vacant. But the apartment planned to compare other flats. on the third floor, no way somebody used the window to escape the murder scene. Costume to enter, a chance for an ally. I'm gonna try this. Oh, it's... Kensa? What's that? Certainly. Let's hang out some other time, okay? Bastard. Got a bad feeling about this. There's the odd placement of ventilation shafts. They seem to smell for anyone to crawl through, though. Hmm. machine. Buy a can of off-brand soda and take a sip. Tastes a little odd, but enjoy the drink anyway. That's probably just Fanta or something. Um, interview the neighbors. For an elevator, you take the rarely stairs, you trip, grab the railing. Breeze and Horde is slowly standing up. Oh. Huh. Uh oh. I can't. 
Oh, it's a ghost enemy. Oh, fuck. I don't have any salt. Shit. Invisible web prevents you from running through- Oh, that's right, I can't run with this god. Uh... God that's currently in control. Fuck, what do I do? Several their ties to our world. Oh. Let's try that. Nope. Right again. There. Fuck you. You ghost. One neighbor's complaining about her underwear missing. That's... not unusual. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Find an envelope lying on a pillow in your bedroom. Inside this cash and a note from someone who has been watching you. They wish you luck in your task and promise to meet you soon. Oh dear. I don't want to investigate my home. I want to go in and... Oh yeah, pressed. Oh, okay. Robots? <laughs> Is the computer I'm playing this on, I guess? Take a short nap. You sit on the couch and read your favorite book. Oh. So that's how you heal in this game. Huh, okay. Oh, this guy again. Hang up immediately. Damn it. Losing all my reason. I'm in this boiler room. Enter the dark boiler room and trip over the pipe. First thing you find a light switch and gasp in horror. It's not a pipe at all! It's a long, rubbery arm coiling around the room and ending in a ventilation shaft. It smells something vile and rotten. I actually had a nightmare that's pretty much exactly like this scenario. Uh, I mean, it was several years ago, but... At my parents' old place, there was like a vent up in the ceiling, and I had this dream that... I went and stood under it, and this, like, hand on this really long arm, like, came out and was, like, trying to grab at me. It was pretty fucked up. Anyway, let's check the vent. Uh, let's empty. Oh god! <laughs> okay. You almost fall to the ground when you see the wide-open stare of the dead, the dead pervert, his elongated limbs stretching and disappearing in the vent's darkness. Building search. Following the arms of Texas, find the body of a man stuck in a ventilation shaft. It's the building caretaker. Find pieces of underwear and voyeur photos of the tenants. Case of unfortunate gas leak. Hey, ending A. Nice. The dog disappeared. Oh no. Oh wait, I don't think they mean my ally, I think they mean the one in the shop. Oh yeah, store closed, okay. Ah, oh, shit. Mmm, it's too cold, Beth. Hello? In storage now. Missing person continues in the forest. Oh. Oh, 
should make a phone call. Powerful saga of the Moonlight Sailors. This involves Sailor Moon. Again, with one fisherman who dragged something truly awful from the belly of the ocean, dark writhing ooze that mesmerized him beyond control. He hid himself away for a week, adoring it. This sounds like the funk from that old Greg video. The young girl spotted his boat drifting away, a single lantern swinging at the helm, singing eerily to his catch. Nope. And the ocean will have taken them all. Hmm. Do I still have the dog with me? Oh, I do. Okay, good. closed. Oh. Edge combat kind of experienced funds. Oh, interesting. Taking a toll on you. God damn it. You brave the stench for hours, you glean nothing besides the fact the fisherman had a wife. Perhaps you should pay her a visit. Yeah, sure. Handle it. Mm, eh, we'll do it. Hey, okay, home. You get there, the terrified mother slams the door in your face. From behind the door, she starts screaming to get the girl away. The little girl only tells you that she can take it from here. Oh. <laughs> okay. Well, you're welcome. Problems with the mansion. Well, to gain a new level, press the flashing button. Fast swimmer. Faster offensive actions. Smaller doom penalty from running from combat or CQC. Let's do this one. Yeah, we'll do more reason. Fisherman's house stands long vacated. Peering in through the dusty window, you recoil in shock. Even a fisherman could afford a mansion. Local legend about a heartbroken. Hey, Coral. Yeah, this game's pretty good. Uh, I'm enjoying it so far. It's... Uh, they, it's weird. They, they want you to play a mission before they teach you how to play. But other than that, um, it's pretty straightforward. And very interesting. Stitched unsuspecting guests together. That's funny. Right through the cover. Oh god, ah. <laughs> um, let's find a sewing kit. Cool. The fisherman's wife lies in the kitchen, mutilated and covered with black marks. Oh. And use this to heal. Then you ask a doctor to do it. <laughs> Probably. One of the previous owners of this mansion like to read. Dusty tomes reach the ceiling. Uh, the shelves. You notice one tome must have been placed here recently. You learn about distant worlds and bizarre rituals. I like the um, old computer game presentation. I think that was a really interesting uh, 
artistic decision, and it lends itself a lot very well to the, uh, the artwork and such. I have, um, so when you start, it's, it gives you a choice of 1-bit or 2-bit, and if you do 2-bit, you can do a little more with, like, colors and stuff, so I have this sort of CGA-looking scheme right now, which makes it seem even more retro. Um, I'm going to Seaside. Hardware store. I have two funds. Can I get anything interesting? Steak knife. Small chance of recovering lost stamina after defeating an enemy. Unless that was worth it. Can't afford that, can't afford that. Uh, seven damage to Elder Gems. Alright, we're gonna go with this. Do you like hurting other people? That's amazing. That's a Hotline Miami reference. went down to the seaside. The young man has glassy eyes and mumbles his replies between caressing his catch. The beating movements in his arms disturb you. <laughs> me. For slow interrogation, the young man manages to stutter out something about an organized fishing trip. Okay. Town stocks are a mix of modern warehouses, small shops, and bars where the alternative crowd gathers. Hmm. I wonder what they mean by alternative. <laughs> Ancient wooden temple occupies a small hill the town center. Uh, I'm guessing if I pray at the temple, there's a chance I could gain some reason back? I don't really need an ally, I already have the dog. And uh, warehouse job, get me funds, I don't really need that at the moment, I don't want to do like this. Let's do reason, pray. <clears throat> Spotlight resource beach, terrified of what comes next. moon shines bright in the cloudless night sky, the ink black ocean waves glimmer eerily. All the residents have drawn the shutters tight and locked their doors. The only sounds are your ragged breathing and pounding heartbeat. So us fishermen's boats fill the horizon with their light. Many yellow spots navigating across the dark ocean under a dark sky. The lanterns move farther and farther away and you hear the out chanting slowly fade with the wind. There's nothing to do now. Ah, oh, shit. No one spoke of the fishermen after they sailed off. Grieving mothers would not let their children anywhere near the cursed beach. Over time, people forgot the last time they saw a boat out on the waves. Oh, man. We were too late. Winds of plague, a weird epidemic keeps staff at the hospital busy. Skipping the line will cost you more.
What the fuck? Once a year, a ramen shop appears where there was once an alleyway. The ramen sold inside is made from its former patrons, but can cure any health problem. Uh, hello, police? <laughs> Neighbor asked you to help. Her husband, Shiro-san, has gone missing. She is worried it might be connected with the new fertilizer he ordered from Tokyo. What is he doing and where is he? A business card of a gardening company where the missing man was working. Maybe some of his colleagues can tell you anything useful. Mycology maniac. Investigate the school location twice to complete this quest. Someone selling mushrooms at the school? Surprised to meet your old friend while in for a train. It's changed a lot since you last seen her. She's moderating a web forum dedicated to the paranormal. Hmm. Oh, what? <laughs> Fuck. Womp womp. Experimental fungicide. an oddly shaped package in the seat opposite you. It's marked with your name. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna investigate. Failure. Someone's suddenly wrapped you in sand with this. You let it fall to the floor from your flesh hands. Uh... Well, the dispatch order is stained with a foul-smelling liquid. You think you can make up the address. Somewhere, somewhere in the nearby forest. <clears throat> Well, I'm gonna do this quest, just because I doubt it will actually lead me there naturally. Time to be out of cash, says the grim-looking man is standing in your way. Our company, fortunately, specializes in cases like yours and will gladly help you get back on track. All you have to do is slap my card with your card and flip it over. If you lose, then I slap you. Yet undefined species of the cordyceps fungus has been observed to infect rats sticking over their bodies. Could have the same effect with other mammals. Yeah, that's a, that's a unlikely but valid concern that Orpheo cordyceps could jump the uh, the species gap. Of course, um, the thing with Orpheo cordyceps is that they infect uh, specifically invertebrates, um, primarily insects. So it's not likely that that would happen, but fungi is very adaptable, so never know. Um, okay, so I'm done at the school. Right. So long the level in this game. The trail to an abandoned Shinto shrine is overgrown and steep. The safe routes. Burnt out candle axe and dried blood around the shrine mean a new sinister cult has claimed this location. It's dark. We're likely to be eaten by a crew. Minus one modifier to all skill check. Faint sound of a telephone line pole. Those strange, uh, giant hairy balls underneath it, they start to twitch and rise. Gross. Ah! Oh, giant scrotum. Tatoru. I'm not familiar with that yokai. 
but uh, 36 health. Uh, can I run? No, I can't run with that god. Ah, oh, fuck. I choose you, dog. Flies closer. Hmm. <gasps> Stained a new injury. Burn. Oh, wonderful. Oh god, look at me. I'm all banished up. Where did it burn me? Not cool, man. You, Totoru. Oh, I leveled. Eyes, quick thinking, discipline. This one decks. One stamina for all past events skill checks, so I'm definitely doing that one. Um. What is my luck? That's not one of the things they show. Hidden stat. Ugh. I'll look up a Tatoru. You know what? I'm gonna do that right now. Yokai Tatoru. Kawa Tatoru. This is a mischievous, troublesome daughter of the legendary cap. Oh, it's an OC. It's. Ugh. Huh. I wonder if it's spelled differently normally. Oh well, anyway. Uh, you can feel gloomy. Oh, wonderful. Doom, 69%. Nice. <laughs> I missed that. Oh, my Doom went up. Damn. So that a famous... Too much Doom. So the famous priest died on this rock. Perhaps his mysticism has seeped into it. Tap into his power. Fail. More Doom. You've been following his gathering in a nearby forest, enacting some sort of a ritual in the clearing of the head. You fall down an inch! <laughs> so... I'll use this. It felt like hours of following the dirt road you find the old mansion. It's completely overgrown with plants you've never seen before. In front of the mansion, there's the gardening company minivan filled with boxes. Slowly, you enter the building with caution. It's in the middle room, so the floor goes up and you fall down to the basement. Cornerless Mac Nice. It's Shiro Song! Just help him escape! Oh no, he wants to fight? Oh, I can only... Oh. Huh. Let's look at his injuries. Shh! 
sure or what. <laughs> Top of his head flies off, revealing his brain. Out of it, the fruiting body of a fungus. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Ah, uh, fuck. Oh god, I have three reasons- oh, I'm not gonna survive this. Uh, where's my dog? Oh no, he's gone. Ah, to flame. Ooh. Costs one reason and one stamina. So dead. Oh, he got me. Fuck. Stamina loss. In time. That was a pretty good run, though. Alright, I think I'll do one more. Tarasu again. I can't escape from combat encounters. Worst. Alright, um. First we go home. Get the. Oh, we get the bottle this time. Never knows. Gain a random spell, lose two reason. Forbidden knowledge. Hmm. Nice day outside. Oh, good. We could leave something to charge here. Do I have anything in my storage? No. right now. Let's watch some TV. Strange tall man dressed in white taking the metro after dark stalking lone passengers. Hmm. Alright, what do we got? Contagious coma. Morbid mermaids. Found footage. Evolving eels. Violent vigil. People fall unconscious and cannot be awakened. As people trying to wake the patients up result with them falling to a coma themselves. The whole wing of the hospital has been dedicated to the comatose. That sounds interesting. Check 
the news reports. Slot, so that's cool. I'm gonna buy the flashlight though, because it seems like that one comes up a little more often. Oh, the batteries are still okay. I don't see anyone on the street, and you could have sworn it was crowded just a minute ago. You better hurry out of here. Sneak into the hospital and borrow the patient zero's information. Kill injuries at the hospital. Oh. <laughs> Covered in scars and babbling about aliens. Immediately understand that the only difference between you and the crazy person is that you haven't been caught yet. <laughs> Convince them to sneak out and join you in your quest. Okay, so who the fuck is this person? Fujiko. Your kick action deals additional one damage. Okay. You hear the... never mind. You had no idea that the funeral you've been invited to would end with the guests slashing their hands to feed the deceased their blood. <laughs> you stay at the back, shocked by how grotesque it is. Suddenly the guests turn their heads in your direction. It's your turn now. <sighs> you know what? When in Rome. As gruesome as it is, it's still a tradition. However, you can't shake the feeling that the deceased smiled slightly as you carefully cut your hands. <laughs> oh, I lost one stamina for that. Got the name and address, let's get out of here. An old priest is performing a ritual to appease a local demon imprisoned underground. You're invited to join them. Sure. You've read about the ritual. Following the intricate pattern of steps, bows, and claps isn't a problem for you. Once the ritual ends, the priest thanks you and hands over an item. Oh, a cursed doll! Thank you so much! To help you understand the illness. Must have seen. Momentarily renders invisible creatures partially visible. Sets enemy power to zero. Wow. That's cool. First doll. Heal four to six damage, costs one to two stamina. Sorry. No. Uh, yeah, what the hell? I'll use these. Seal of Bramel. Plus one knowledge, discard on use. Plus four reason. Mm. Sleeping nurse. You 
abandon the idea of stealing the patient's document. It will hamper your investigation for sure, but a well-rested nurse means a safer hospital. Oh, I didn't realize- Ah, oh, fuck. Well... Some patients took part in art classes. Some of their work fills you with dread. Oh yeah, oh, that's- that's... <sighs> I'm pretty sure that's Nair Latotep. Let me look it up. Uh, Sigil Nair Latotep. Oh, maybe it is the king in yellow. Okay, yeah, it is the king in yellow. Alright. I knew it was one of them. Minus two reason. That sucks. Patient Zero's house seems empty. You should search it carefully. Heidi stands a pretty woman in sweater. Natural beauty. Yes, this is exactly what I need. You shudder seeing the weird woman reaching to her pocket and grabbing a nasty looking knife. Pretty face. Mind if I borrow it? Aspiring model. Mm. Hmm. 18 power. Can I blind her with a flashlight? No. I, oh, I don't have a weapon. <laughs> Take that bitch. Lucky earrings. The man dabbled in magic. He found a journal. Describing a certain village and instructions for a summoning ritual. It seems that he's trying to come back to being from the dream realms. Okay, we'll let's see what are these. Plus two of luck. Run into labyrinth. Oh no. Back to the hospital, huh? He's branding the patients with occult symbols. <laughs> Assume the worst. Branded like cattle. <laughs> Quarantine wing. I managed to sneak through the floor, avoiding the police, and finally reach the quarantine wing where all the coma patients were brought in. Your pulse is slowly weakening and the blood pressure dropping. You must hurry. Let's use the dust of seed. Aha! It reveals weird elongated monsters hanging from the ceiling, one above every bed. Each creature is connected to a patient with an undulating tendril. To try to process everything one of the disgusting creatures raises its head and looks in your direction. Let's take notice of you. You must defend yourself or perish. What a weird. Green devourer. I still don't have a fucking weapon. Tears your flesh. Oh no. Uh, Crystal? Oh, stamina. Fuck, I don't want that. Um, let's improvise a weapon. And then attack with that weapon? No. Unbroken bottle.
Mind is on fire. God. This thing's gonna kill me, isn't it? Unplug life support. Deals 15 damage. It costs 3 reason. dies and one of the tendrils disappears. My health dropped too low, you will die at the beginning of your next encounter. Ah, son of a bitch. Well, that was World of Horror, um, or at least a taste of it. There is a lot to this game beyond what I've seen um, from all that I know of it. Uh, I definitely look forward to playing more of this, and I will probably stream more of this as well uh, later. Um, yeah, this game is really good. I like it a lot. It definitely does have that... Uh, Lovecraft and Junji Ito inspiration to it. Um, it comes through very strongly, which is good. That's what I wanted out of it. Um, special thank you to Mana for buying this for me. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to leave it there. Since I have a few of you, I'm going to look for someone we can raid. Um, I do that. What's on my... And, uh, so tomorrow I will be off. Um, I sh I'll probably be back. I mean, the rest of the week I'm pretty open. Uh, actually, uh, I do have something planned for Wednesday. Well, um, just keep an eye on notifications. I'll be streaming again when I can. Um, so who can we go to? Let's find someone from my streaming group. Let's see. Who is online? Someone new. Who I was following before? Okay, this person's playing Half Life, and I'm very tempted. I'd like to stick to a horror game, but I think we're going to do Half-Life. Oh, yeah, this is the person I was talking to on Discord. That's why I recognize their name. Awesome. Okay, we're going to we're going to read them. Oops. All right, cool. So uh, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll catch you in the next one.